All right, we have got an all new update for Samsung's Reminder application, which brings in a couple of new cool features, which are going to be really useful in our day-to-day -day life. Now with this all new update, it has become much more easier to set a reminder. Let's go ahead and take a look at what we have here. As you can see the change log here, it says, can now quickly create reminders, improved how to choose a date and time. Let me now open Reminder app to show you these two features. As you can see at the bottom, we have got this huge plus button to add a reminder and we also have this bar over here on the left. If you look at the previous version, we have to tap on this plus mark on the top right corner to add a reminder. Now we have this at the bottom. Now let me try to add a reminder here. I'll tap on this bar. Let's type place grocery orders tomorrow at 8 a.m. As you can see, as we type the time, it will recognize the time and automatically add the reminder at that particular time. So we don't have to select the time again. Just tap here to add the reminder. As you can see, it says place grocery orders tomorrow at 8 a.m. Automatically it has taken tomorrow's date and 8 a.m. That is just fantastic. This feature was added even on the calendar app a few weeks ago and even there, it's the same way we add an event, you just key in the time or day, it automatically takes it and saves it. This makes life much easier on the phone, isn't it? Now the second feature is improved how to choose a date and time. Let's open the app. Now let's not tap on this bar here. Let me tap on this plus button. As you can see, we have got memo to be written on the top. Below this, we have got options to add time and date. If you look at the previous version, this is how it used to look. We've got this date and time here and on the right hand side we have got calendar icon which you can tap to set the days. But this way of setting the date and time is kind of confusing. Uh, if you need the entire calendar to be displayed, you have to first select the all day and then tap on this particular icon to open the calendar to see the entire calendar days. Or tap on time to see the days and the time at the same time to select a particular date or time. But with this all new update, it has become much more intuitive. The layout is clean and simple. We just have two taps here. Tap on the first one to open the entire calendar of the month and then tap on time to set a particular time for that particular day that you have selected. Very simple and clean and it's quite intuitive to add a date and time with this all new update now. This is a great feature enhancement on this particular application which was much needed. Kudos to Samsung for providing this update. That's all I want to share with you guys. Let me know your thoughts about it and if you're new on the channel, make sure to subscribe to watch some cool contents on Samsung Galaxy phones, Android apps, One UI, MIUI, etc. And do smash that like button if you find this video useful. Thanks a lot for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. I will see you in the next one. Cheers. Bye-bye.